I see a boat. Mom used to tell me about them. Didn't think they were actually real. Nightmares? Yeah. They give people nightmares. Or they are nightmares. I don't remember which. I wish I could ask. Here we go! under the surface. No. It's pitch black. Then do not touch the water. <laughs> Atreus, to me. Look how close we are. We flow into seawater. How do you know? Do you not smell it? If that smells the sea, the sea stinks. Look at that. It's Thor. Thor. God of Thunder. That's right. I never thought you'd listen when Mother spoke of the gods. I seldom did. Did she speak of one who could feel no pain? Oh. That sounds like Balder. Balder. An Aesir god. Son of Odin and Frigg. And Odin is king. That's right. 
Why do you ask? I see rooms there. This chest. Can't quite make it out. It reads, sacrifice your arms to the center of the water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Are you gonna do it? wasn't there before, see? And there's the mountain. Look it, that building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There, next to the flag. We're going to the dock first, right? We'll be the first people to walk on it, and who knows how long. You know that serpent? He's one of the giants. He's so big, he's wrapped around the whole world and bites his own tail. An exaggeration. I don't know. Looked pretty big to me. <laughs> How long do you think this has been here? A very long time. Is this the way to the mountain? It would seem. If it isn't the bearded fever, it is sexy. Have I got something for you too? Brock? But how did you? None of your fucking business. Now get in here, I got something for you. And don't go making pig eyes at my spot. I saw it first. Okay. <sighs> what do you think he wants? to test our patience. When word gets out about my new shop, folks will finally come out of hiding. They'll be clawing all over each other just to catch a whiff of my wares. You watch. Catch! The pile of rocks there, with that key of Yggdrasil, you can open a magic door to the branches of the World Tree. A shortcut between the realms. 
If you ever see him out in the world, use it to get back to me quick. But it's only one way. Straight back here and nowhere else. And whatever you do, never, never, ever, never, ever throw yourself over the edge of the path, lest you want death. Yeah, I don't see us wanting that. Always a pleasure. Now fuck right along. What is this? A horn. Here's the end. Can we blow into it? Without knowing the outcome? Well, we usually push every button, pull every lever we see. Outcomes we can predict. No. This is something else. We must develop your instincts. I knew it! We are blowing the horn! No. We are testing your resolve. I have resolve. A bunch of it. these rooms. If we find a cipher, I bet I could figure it out. I told you, we should come back with a cipher. I still can't read these. Another one here. Look! It's the World Serpent. He's so much bigger than I imagined. Oh, look! He bit Thor! Or will bite him. Looks like.
What is that? It smells awful. Poison. We should look for more like this. Oh, what were those things? They smell awful. Your mother called them scorn poles. Poison magic. She was the one who showed me how to disable them. <laughs> what? It's just funny to think of her teaching you something. Yeah. Whoa. Sure is foggy here. Another dwarf. Should we... No. He is of no consequence. Uh... Excuse me, but, um, how did you come by that, uh, axe? That is my concern alone. And, uh, while I won't dispute that, I, I know that blade. It was one of ours, but, uh, <laughs> we didn't make it for you. Step aside. I can't. See, the woman we made it for, I was, uh, well, I am quite fond of her, and I would be somewhat displeased if it turns out that... <laughs> You did something to her. It was my mother's. She left it to father before she died. Face dead? I'm very, very sorry to hear that. She was a fierce warrior. And a good woman. Okay. I will make improvements to the axe. But nobody asked you to. Well, it's, it's true, but but knowing your mother, <laughs> she would have insisted I repair that act of vandalism perpetrated against her axe by my brother. I knew it. You are Brock's brother. The other half of the brand's here. The blue one is your brother. Yes. Though my talents are vastly superior. <laughs> no boast. I swear to Freya. Do not undo his work. Improve upon it only. Yeah, but can you can you put it down over there? That handle is. No. There? Filthy. Okay, then. I'll just... I will just... Oh. 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 Oh, is that dried blood? Oh. So, what were you working on? Oh, that. I call it the Sky Mover. Just up that mountain waits a treasure trove of rare resources. 
Once I mine it, I'll need a way to bring it all down. And you know how to fix it? Not even a little. You think all dwarves are as weird as Brock and Sindri? No. I feel like they don't get along anymore. I mean, they're family. That is their matter alone, boy. Okay. Atreus, to me.
wish we could have gone on a trip like this with Mother. She could fight, couldn't she? Yes, she fought beautifully. will swarm to the flames like moths. I assume we have you to thank for freeing us from a watery grave. Us? Other spirits. The Lake of Nine is full of them. Most are able to move on from this realm, but we, lucky few, are stuck here in Midgard until our affairs are in order. Perhaps you can help them as well. We have no desire to help you, spirit. Ah, but you already have. I only wished to see the sky again. Farewell. Oh, he disappeared. Come, let us not be distracted. together. we should keep an eye out for other spirits. What did I say about distractions? But it sounds like they needed help. They are spirits, boy. Dead things. They have no needs. Only wants. It feels wrong to ignore them. We will get over these feelings. Mom would have wanted to help them. What was that, boy? Nothing. I thought as much. Any good stories to pass the time? What kind of story? I don't know. 
Mother always had stories. Weren't you told me when you were a boy? There was a man I knew of long ago. His stories were brief and purposeful. Sounds fun. Do you remember any? Enough. Stories are for the boat. We must focus. Yes, sir. Okay, that's going in the journal. Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. Read it. Sir. Uh, these rooms read death inside. It's a pleasure. Now fuck- What is it, Dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari. Been working out in the Velander mines. Haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me. Wears a fancy green ring. Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Fine. If you find Donvari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. The Velander Mines is right through these doors. Might as well have a look see inside, don't you think? I need that alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. If when you're smart, so, you'll find him. So, Brock said his friend was dwarven like him. Wearing a green ring. Look if you wish. I will be gathering resources for our journey. You don't want to help him? No. Why not? Because I do not run errands for dwarves. Oh. Dwarven. But no ring. One of his crew? Scorch marks. There, along the floor and wall. Weird. I guess we keep looking. We? I mean, I'll keep looking. That kills us. That's it. No Valhalla, no hell, no afterlife, ever. It does not attack. Oh. Mom made them sound more dangerous than that. Then do not drop your guard. Come.
Check this out. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. There's the ring! On that severed hand! Attached to the Soul Eater. We know what happened to Invari now. We can just go tell Brock. No need to fight it, right? No, we will fight it. But why? Because you are frightened of it.
This is crazy. How are we supposed to kill something made of rock? Be strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Read it. Yes, sir. These runes were written fast. It spells out Ejim Staney. Hmm. I don't know that one. You asked me one. And now you're interested? We found his alchemist. A reward was promised. <laughs>
What'd you find? You're an alchemist. I'm sorry, bro. The hand is all we could find. Still wearing the ring. There was a soul eater inside. And, well, it must have burned away the rest of him. Suppose you'll still be wanting some compensation, huh? Naturally. Naturally, he says. Miani Feruxi. I'll take a closer look at this here ring. Maybe Anvari left 